This is the homework help video for physics homework 6.1. I'll do numbers 1 and 3. In number 1, we've got Bud, who's a very large man of mass, 130 kilograms. Kilograms. And he stands on a pogo stick. How much work is done as he compresses the spring of the pogo stick? Uh, a distance of 0 .050 meters. So our distance here is 0 .050 meters. <clears throat> Uh, the only problem that we have here is that we're not given a force. We're going to use the equation work equals force times distance, obviously, um, but we're not given a force here. To find that, we're going to use F equals ma. We know a mass, and our acceleration here is just gravity because we're looking for Bud's weight. Uh, so we'll use 130 kilograms times 10 meters per second squared to get 1,300 newtons for our force. Now we're set up and we can plug into that work equation. So work equals 1300 newtons times 0 .050 meters. Newtons times meters is going to give us joules. And we should get there uh, 665, excuse me, 1300 times 0 .05 is 65 joules of work. So your answer for number one should be 65 joules. On number three, uh, this one's also fairly straightforward for us. Um, we've got Marissa doing 3.2 joules of work to lower the window shade in her bedroom, a distance of 0.8 meters. So she's lowering it at a distance of 0.8 meters. How much force must she exert on the window shade? So we're looking here for force. Work equals force times distance. 3.2 joules equals force times point zero or sorry point eight. See what I did there? Meters. Divide by point eight meters. And we should get four newtons equals the force. Pretty straightforward set of homework questions there. I hope that helped.